Land Rover is an iconic brand going above and beyond for over 70 years. Today, Land Rover encompasses two distinct vehicle families. The Range Rover, the Defender. Incomparable, unstoppable, a category of its own. Our new Defender is not just one vehicle. It never was. Our new Defender is a family too. V90, V110, and the commercial versions, including plug-in hybrids. Today, I give you back the new Defender, the best ever. Thank you. The day has finally come. Ladies and gentlemen, today we introduce the new Defender family to join our highly refined Range Rover and supremely versatile Discovery families. So ladies and gentlemen, it's an honour for me to reveal the new Defender family. So, this is the new Defender 90. It measures just over 4.3 meters, and it is the toughest, most capable Land Rover ever. So, ladies and gentlemen, these are the new Defender 110s. Now, the 110, now, in most of the respects, the 90 and the 110 are the same design. Every element of the exterior design of these vehicles has been really carefully considered, all to reinforce the unique DNA of the new Defenders. And the interiors are equally as compelling. There'll be various versions at launch. These two vehicles here are called the first edition. And this one here is the Defender X. Now, we've also developed four design packs to offer customers more choice and to cater for different lifestyle opportunities. And these design packs really do demonstrate the ability of the new Defender to change its personality with that while still retaining its design and engineering integrity. Here we have two of those design packs. This version here is the Adventure Pack, and it's presented here with the Red Cross livery. This year marks a 65-year partnership between the Red Cross and Land Rover, and the new Defender will play its role in, this, in supporting the Red Cross in its humanitarian activities. Over here, we have the Explorer Pack, and together with the adventure, the urban, and the country, they represent the biggest collection of accessories we've ever created for a Land Rover product. And more importantly, they've all been designed and engineered in parallel with the core vehicle to ensure design and engineering integrity and Land Rover authenticity. So this is the commercial derivative of, of the 90 and a handsome thing it is too with its white roof and white steel wheels. Yes, I said it as a designer, steel wheels. They look fabulous on, on this car. So, ladies and gentlemen, I'm delighted to say that at last, the Land Rover family is now complete. Thank you. 
It's a, a very emotional experience and it was a great honour to present the new Defenders to the world. It's a great honour to actually represent all the many people that have worked tirelessly, tirelessly to bring this very important vehicle to, to production, to, to reality. These vehicles, um, they are the toughest and most capable Land Rover de Defenders ever made. So we have a three door. Um, and when you look at it, it has um, an instantly recognisable silhouette. But that silhouette is very much a modern interpretation of the originals. And its proportion is um, optimised to achieve a well-balanced design, while also with its short, o minimal overhangs and high sill, supreme all-terrain capability. So it's design and engineering together. A lot of very careful consideration has gone into this design to reinforce Defender, the new Defender's unique DNA. When you look at the face, and it's the same for the 90 and the 110, it adds a character full face. It's, it communicates strength and confidence. Simple, reductive, modern grill, bumpers, and very also simple geometric forms for the front lamps, which are highly technical beautifully sculpted fenders that run the whole length of the body. And then when you look at the rear, it's that verticality that's most prominent. And that's been done to minimize this overhang because that's what capability is all about. At launch, um, there'll be different versions. We have the, uh, the first editions, um, and we also have X-Dynamic. And these vehicles on display here, you'll see they're all uh, presented in a satin finish. Now that was the intent right from the beginning because the satin finish communicates the solidity and the durability of this vehicle. Well, I think the important thing was we, we recognise the unique history of our brand. We, we recognise the uniqueness of the Defender that over time it has acquired iconic status. But at the same time, this vehicle is designed for a new generation. And I think it was important to recognize the heritage but not be harnessed by it. You know, there was no point doing a retrospective um, facsimile of the original because it wouldn't be relevant anymore. But I think the car does. And I hope our Land Rover, traditional Land Rover enthusiasts can see it. We have acknowledged the, the essence of um, of the original Defender, and that comes through, is projected through the honesty of the design. Engineering the new Defender was an incredible thing to do. We had the opportunity to have a blank sheet of paper and just reinvent that authentic capability. The Defender's always been the vehicle that everybody's loved, everybody has cared, and it's always been the vehicle that's helped everybody. At Land Rover, we have the ability to do the unthinkable, to do the impossible. So we made a vehicle that is incredible off-road, and you can see how those physicals shone straight through what we did, and you can see that the car has been engineered with functionality first. We've also pushed the second dimension. The on-road feel is absolutely incredible. The agility of the car is incredible, and the key thing is it will put a smile on your face. And as an engineering team, we just sat down and we said, we want this car to be the best. So the suspension is so capable, it's 500 millimetres of suspension travel. The vehicle is very short at the front, it's very short at the rear. We put the spare wheel on the back of the car, so it's absolutely the physicals. And those fantastic 815 millimetre diameter tyres that we've got on that vehicle give a really, really large contact patch, so it treads lightly on all surfaces, and you can drive over absolutely any terrain. Well, it's an absolutely fantastic day for us here at Land Rover, revealing our all-new Defender. I'm so proud of the teams in the UK and also the teams in Slovakia that have worked tirelessly over the last few years to bring this fantastic new car to the market. This really is the most capable Land Rover we've ever done. We've created an all new bespoke architecture. It's incredibly tough. You can withstand peak loads of seven tonnes through the suspension. You can carry 300 kilograms on the roof. Uh, statically, you can go dynamically with 168 kilograms on the roof point recovery loads at the front and rear are six and a half tonnes and you can tow the legal maximum in any country around the world, so up to three and a half tonnes in Europe. 
but off-road it's just immense. You can go on any surface anywhere in the world, you've got amazing geometry, amazing suspension technology. This car will go as far as you want to anywhere. Well, we've got a full portfolio of products on the stand here today from both the Jaguar brand and the Land Rover brand. From the new XE, fantastic car, brilliant to drive, refined, comfortable and luxurious. All the way through our, to our Discovery family, the new Evoque, the Range Rover, the Range Rover Sport and of course our new Defender. And we're just so proud here to be here in Frankfurt representing everybody in the company with all of these cars on our stand. Defender is crucial to Land Rover as a brand. It's the Land Rover brand icon. And now we've got the family full. We've got the Range Rover family, the Discovery family, and finally here it is, the Defender family, the iconic part of the three. Starting with commercial, it sounds like it's the, the poor relation to all these amazing accessory packs and tents on roofs and so on. But commercial is really important for the identity of Defender. Defender has always been a car that's rooted in utility and robustness and obviously commercial highlights this. So it was very important to us to have commercial here with us today. When you look at the packs, people love customizing their Land Rovers. People love customizing Defenders from uh, painting them matte black and having wide wheels on them to making them as off-road capable as possible. And we've been anticipating the demand and been providing for different use cases, for an urban use case, for the real off-road use case, everything a customer could possibly imagine, both as a pack and in terms of accessories, highlight surely being the tent you can sleep in on the roof, the mobile washer unit so you can wash down your wellies after a walk in the mud or your bike and all of these items. Electrification requires much more than just developing a car. We obviously need to be able to make batteries and we need to make them very close to where we'll be building our cars, hence the investment in Hams Hall. All sites have to be fully prepared for electrification. We look at Castle Bromwich and it will become one of our core competence centers for the manufacture of electric cars. We have today showcased XJ coming into Jaguar Land Rover as yet another fully electric Jaguar product and we need a home for that. The Frankfurt Motor Show is arguably one of the most important car shows in the world. Um, most visitors we see in Frankfurt, it is the home of arguably one of the most important premium car building countries. So to launch such an important vehicle at such an important show is really important for us. To finally reveal Defender here after more than 70 years of the first generation is truly exciting for us. It is exciting for everybody at Land Rover, but it's also exciting for the fans and for all the customers out there who have been waiting for a new Defender for a new era. What we are showcasing here is that Defender is not just a car, it is a whole family of cars. Um, it is the 90, very compact, it is the 110, a Swiss knife of a car that can do everything. Um, we offer a commercial version um, as a true work tool and the cars can be adapted to almost any needs that our customers have because we offer more than 170 accessories that can really personalize the car to whatever you throw at it. Defender is very significant for Land Rover because when you think about the Land Rover master brand, every single Land Rover is the most capable in its segment. But then the Range Rover family adds to that refinement, almost luxury. The Discovery models add to that versatility, the ultimate car for the adventurous family. But there has always been something missing the past years. It was like a two-legged stool. Now we add the third leg to the stool, and this is Defender, because Defender brings to Land Rover this ultimate unstoppability and durability that only a Defender can deliver.
Yeah, that's my name.